Hello, my name is Catherine Jilks, and I am the Education Outreach Coordinator at Heritage Saskatchewan. One of my main roles is coordinating the Heritage Fairs and High School Heritage Challenge programs in the province. Heritage Saskatchewan's involvement in the program began in 2013. The program has since evolved to include an online virtual Heritage Fair, as well as the High School Heritage Challenge, a new online contest for grades 9 through 12. Heritage Saskatchewan hosts the Virtual Heritage Fair, which is held online and is open to all Saskatchewan students in grades 4 through 8, and the Provincial Heritage Fair, which is held in person and features student finalists selected from the Regional and Virtual Heritage Fairs. Regional Heritage Fairs are held in person throughout the province, organized by local volunteer committees. The judging process is similar throughout all of the Heritage Fairs. Three judges independently view each project presentation, whether in person or online, and the scores are averaged. The higher their average score, the more likely students are to be selected to advance to the Provincial Heritage Fair or to receive awards and prizes. Judges' scores are based on students' research, such as factual accuracy, as well as their historical thinking, communication, and creativity. The High School Heritage Challenge is a newer contest that Heritage Saskatchewan has created for high school students. It is similar in format to the Virtual Heritage Fair. For both contests, Students submit their projects to Heritage Saskatchewan's website by the end of April, and the judging process is the same. The winners and runners-up are announced at the beginning of June. The object of the High School Heritage Challenge is for students to connect with a heritage topic that they have a strong passion for and that is meaningful to them. This contest is aimed at independent students, though full classes are welcome to take part. Winners receive an education bursary of $1,000. We hope that you will promote this program and encourage your students to participate. To conclude, projects can vary widely in shape. They can be display boards, written reports, videos, slideshow presentations, models, dioramas, artifacts, photos, games, poetry, or a combination of any of those. For specific information about projects, please see our website, where we have free downloadable booklets in English and French, as well as frequently asked question sections. We also have a whole video series about how to create virtual heritage fair projects. That series is aimed at both students and educators. Ultimately, the Heritage Fairs and High School Heritage Challenge are about telling stories. Whose stories are being told about Canada? How have these stories changed? What values and traditions are being passed on? What languages are being used? How are we facing truth and reconciliation? How do we in Canada, in Saskatchewan, in our respective communities see ourselves? How do others see us? How do the students see themselves? In sharing these stories, students not only learn, but teach. Every year, judges tell me that they've learned something new or gained a new perspective. Students get the chance to share their stories beyond their classrooms. Thank you for watching and listening today. I hope that you will share our program throughout your communities and school divisions.